convincing, the bullet portion. It was five and a half, five and a half, going into the final segment, the bullet. Yeah. And for those of you guys who are wondering, because I'm sure there are definitely some people from Arizona watching, that Fide Master, he since he's still active teaching chess quite frequently, his name is Robbie Adamson. So if anyone in chat <laughs> is from Arizona and knows Robbie, you should definitely make sure to ask him the story about that game. Um, Levy, I think, tricked air. Is this just a draw? Or is this this is just winning by force, right? E6? It looks like Black is getting Yeah, you crushed. go E6, E7. This is a well-known trap. E6, E7, and Bishop G5. Yeah. Yeah, this is just, uh, Eric walked into, uh, this is just an opening trap. Yeah, it was just Oh, over. well. So I guess Knight it's F3 incredible is the move here. Mm -hmm. How convincing the bullet portion is. I was just thinking that it we started with five and a half, five and a half, literally before the bullet games. And and now it's just, it's, it seems like a clean sweep. Uh, do you think that it makes a difference for Eric that this 1-0 and not 1-1 one, one for the bullet? 1-1 one, one is such a strange one, though. Yeah, I think, I mean, 1-1 one, one is very, very tricky because it still is bullet and you can't really get way behind on the clock. But if but with the increment, it's definitely different um, as opposed to just regular 1-0. So it's very hard to play a mix between, like, spending time.